parents are traditional Asian parents. They came to America wanting a better future for their children. And when I got into magic, they were pretty worried because they wanted their son to have a very stable job and future. Applying for college, my father recommended business because he was also a business major. And it turned out to be probably one of the best decisions of my life. In my startup company, the magic fits perfectly with networking with people and connecting with them. I really want to live life doing what I love, what I'm passionate about, and magic is just that. He isn't old enough to drink, but he is old enough to drive. Penn and Teller crazy, that is. Give it up for 19-year-old Kevin Lee. How many experiences do you have in a year? How many do you actually remember? How many do you want to remember? To make sure I remember everything worthwhile, about a year ago, I challenged myself to take one instant photo every single week of my most favorite memory. I would then attach the photo to a playing card, something I always have on me. A deck has 52 cards, just like a year has 52 weeks. <laughs> when we look at photos, it takes us back to that moment in time and we almost feel what we felt then. This was my birthday celebration with a few of my closest friends. Just looking at this photo right now brings me back. I feel like I'm there right now. I hear all the sounds. Let's see. Oh, this was taken after a 5K race. And it was my personal record. Wait, is that a... That's a photo bomber right there. <laughs> I know what we can do. We can just take that photo bomber right off. And now that looks pretty good. But I think it can look a lot better if my hair wasn't so out of place. So watch my hair. Not here. Here. <laughs> If we get a small breeze like this. My hair is now back into place. And that looks really good. Hashtag no filter. Ah, here we go. My brand new record player. I love listening to its music but I also enjoy watching the vinyl spin round and around. When it spins, that's when the music starts. So, needs to be a bit faster. Tonight is actually the last week of my one photo per week challenge. Here, I have the last card. These are memories for me to keep, but I want tonight to be a memory that all of you will keep. So, I have a photo for all of you. Sometimes we want to relive our memories and make them last a bit longer. This moment I have with all of you right now, I want to suspend it more.
I said, this moment with all of you here brings my year full circle. Thank you. so much do you involve social media in your act all the time yeah definitely i think social media is a great way to reach out to a lot more people because i want my magic to be relatable to people i want the magic to be the medium between us and conversations yeah and the magic and i would imagine that that you being so cute young thanks you i try have a big following <laughs> Allison, i'm sure a lot of people take photos of you right a time or two. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> they will after this. Yeah. So, do you happen to make funny faces sometimes in the photos? Mm, all the time. Okay. So, how about both of us try to make our funniest faces okay. and look right there on the count of three? Okay. All right? Three. One, two, two three. three. <laughs> I love it. There's going to be a, a meme or a gif of that in like two weeks. Awesome. All right. Well, uh, let's see what the guys think. Okay. All right. Boys. Uh, you know, Kevin, I think it's important to point out that the um, first things Teller said to me, when we first were supposed to be working on your trick, was Teller said to me, uh, isn't that the most perfect routine you'd want to do when you were that age? Isn't that exactly what you want to say when you're looking at how your life is going to add up? And Teller, uh, I will say, was really, really choked up by it. So um, uh, the whole emotion of the routine was really, uh, was really, really beautiful and spoke directly to Teller. And if Teller were the one who was doing the speaking, he'd be talking right now about uh, how important the emotional content is. And sometimes we get so tied up in tricks and trickery that we forget that it actually is, when all is said and done, art. And you're supposed to be speaking a little bit from your heart. And you spoke from your heart in a way that spoke directly to Teller's heart. So we can talk about, uh, you know, uh, color changes on the card moves. And we can talk about rising cards. And uh, we can talk about the thread of the story being held together and all of that stuff that you did. Uh, we had a pretty good idea how you did the tricks. I hope I gave you a little sneak. But more important than that, I think you spoke to Teller in a way that a uh, few other performers have or did. Thank you so much. Uh, Thank you. So, did you hear enough to know that they figured it out? I did. But I'm totally what fine an with incredible that. compliment. <laughs> yes. All right. Thank you, Kevin Thank Lee. You so much. Thank, you. Thank you. How's it going, everyone? Thank you so much for tuning into my fullest episode. If you enjoyed that, please hit that like button and subscribe for more content coming up. You can always keep update with me at Kevin Lee Magic. All the social media links will be posted down below. So I made a separate video talking about my experience on the show and my thoughts afterwards. That's going to be in a separate video right over here. So go check that out. But that's it for now. Thank you again and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.